plaintiff, LaToya Jordan, met the defendant on a dating website. But after their first date, she knew they were better off as friends. LaToya claims one night she and the defendant were in her car, and one of the defendant's girlfriends saw them and shot up her car 13 times. So she's suing. Defendant Kendall Irving says whenever he hung out with LaToya, his other female friends interrogated him about their relationship. Kendall admits that his girlfriend shot LaToya's car, but says LaToya should be suing her. Start with you. Okay, um, so I met the defendant a couple years ago on a dating website. Um, after our first date, I just pretty much knew that it would never work in a relationship because he's just like too good looking. I call him like an old spice man and I just... What? <laughs> well, Go ahead. still... He's a 10 and I don't have time for tennis shoes. Like I wear heels, not tennis shoes. Um, so we just used to hang out, chill, do all that stuff. I was in an eight year relationship that I got out of. So he really did like help guide me through this new single life because everything is so different now. Um, we just used to hang out. I used to have to listen to his stories about his girls. Then they started like texting me, threatening me to stay away from him or like giving me nasty looks and things like that. And like those How are the did issues. they find out about you? I, well, we used to hang out all the time. Like okay. I was and always he, with him. All right. And you so. say girls, meaning he had a couple mm -hmm. girlfriends or a few or what have you. Yeah. And they would see you all out. Yeah. All right. Would you meet them? Um, I mean, I think we like ran into each other. Like if they were leaving and I was mm -hmm. coming to Would he the house. introduce you? No. Or would he ask, could you go? Stand over in the corner. No, 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 no. I, no. I was best friend, so if anybody was leaving, it was going to be them. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to leave that alone, but <laughs> you don't give the same feeling. You do not come before his girlfriends, I promise you. You can think you do, <laughs> but as your platonic friend, you can't do what his girlfriend does. Go ahead, sir. Let me hear from you. Well, just as she stated, uh, we did meet on the site, and uh, I was just trying to introduce her back to the single life and, you know, had a casual date here and there. And as she said, she may have come by the, the, the residence a time or two and saw other friends of mine. and uh, That you were intimate with? Yes, sir. Okay. Honestly. That's I, my point. You can't top intimacy. Go ahead. <laughs> I found a good way to say it. That's yeah. Right. Wow. Okay. Yes, sir. And, um, you know, I, honestly, I, I did see good in Miss Latoya Jordan. So, you know, I, I allowed her to be over and, and come over. And that and Miss, uh, she got to see the other friends of mine. And what would they say? Oh, I had, yeah, all kinds of problems. Who, who, is, who is this? Why is she here? Did what you she introduce doing? them? No. Why? I just because they crazy, Your Honor. Man, they crazy. That's why. Yeah. Okay, so they wouldn't have accepted an introduction as a platonic friend. No, they no. would have immediately that, accused you that. and become jealous and irate. I, exactly. All right. I allowed her to come over, and she got to see the other friends of mine. Yeah, and what would they say? Who is this? Why is she here? Did Where's you introduce her? No. Why? Because they crazy, your honor. Defendant Kendall Irving is being sued by his former friend, who claims while they were hanging out in her car, one of Kendall's female friends saw them and shot the car 13 times. The car, what happened? So with the car, I moved out of town after we, you know, developed this friendship and I end up coming back in town to see him. Of course, I want to see my best friend and a girl a girl, I don't know if they was living together. A girl saw us together, started acting all crazy or whatever, shot my car. And, you know, then she shot my car like 13 times or something like that. But, I mean, mm, he was mm, there. Mm. Yeah, you date crazy women. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was there. He sort of kept me safe out of, you know what I'm saying, harm's way. And it was really kind of like sweet, I guess. But, I mean, as sweet as it could be. But Did you press charges? Yes, I did. did. Was she sentenced or um, convicted? She's, we're still sentenced? going through the court process with that. She has a court today, actually. Okay, what was your response to that? To to the whole shooting? Honestly, mm -hmm. I, I, I was just 
in fear of my life. I thought I was dead. She was crazy. You know, a friend of mine. How long had you known her? My my lady friend. The one that shot up the car. A year. Buddy, working you were on the year. Dating her for a year? Yeah, working on a year. And you didn't know she was that uh violent no. for lack of a better. No, no. See, honestly, it was a third party that got it all started. Saw me getting out of Latoya Jordan's car at, at my residence and called my lady friend. I don't know what was told or what was said, but she comes in the house on 10 and I'm trying to leave. So I called Jordan back up. Hey, I need to leave. As soon as I get in the car around the corner, my lady friend pulls up in her car. And, you know, I guess she sees me in the car with this young lady and, you know, had, shooting. started shooting. 13 times. Four of them hit the engine block and the rest of them hit the car, so. Yeah, so my car was Do you think she went out of her way not to hit? Uh, no. No, she, she, no. She was trying to hit something. Wow. Yeah. That's horrible. Yeah, yeah. What does they charge her with? Uh, I don't know. Right now, she, like I said, she just, uh, well, I know yeah. they'll. Wow. All right, nothing funny about court that. Court today. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. And how are you attributing the damage to him? Um, Because he agreed right then and there that he would, well, right then and there, he agreed that he would pay for my car when he got his income taxes. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. that's funny. <laughs> but then I ended up getting my taxes first, and he is aware that I have five kids and I needed a car. So he agreed to just... Once How old are you, ma'am, if you don't mind? I'm 27. Five children, okay. Yeah, no wonder you didn't want to be nothing but friends. Go ahead. So, um, but after that, he he did end up agreeing to pay the balance for me to get a new car. Um, and so... Did he admit that he was wrong or something? Yeah, he, he agreed right then and there. And I said, did he admit that he was wrong? Did yes. he say I was wrong because I did such and such wrong? Yes. What did he say he did wrong? He just said he shouldn't have me come back over there that night. Like, I should have... Allowing you to come to the house, he says, yes. was wrong? Yes. Sir? Sir? You all right? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out if that's what You're I really said. I don't think I said that. <laughs> no. No, you think of you having a flashback. Yeah, I, I had a flashback and all of that. Like, huh? Tow, 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 tow. <laughs> tow, tow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Take your time. Get back to me when you can. Oh, yeah, that was, yeah, that yeah. was very traumatic. Yeah, I, 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 was, I was a little irate and too traumatic to be like, it was my fault. I think it was the shooter's fault. In, in, in any reality. You did not tell her you believed it was your fault? No. I don't, I don't see myself taking that kind of ownership to that. Well, he did. No. Why do you think he changed his mind? Um, I don't necessarily think he changed his mind. His story was that once he got his taxes, student loans had taken the money, mm -hmm. so it was never like, I'm not going to pay you. When did he tell you that? Um, I have a text message. I don't know the... Let's see it, please. Defendant Kendall Irving is being sued by his former friend, who claims while they were hanging out in her car, one of Kendall's female friends saw them and shot the car 13 times. However, ma'am, he still had to admit to uh, having been uh, responsible for it. Otherwise, he's promising a gift because inviting somebody over who... Uh, engaged in criminal activity, he didn't do anything wrong. Well, he told me right then and there, like, we've discussed it plenty And that's a gift. That's a promise of a gift. He wants to give you a gift to make up for what somebody well, did to fine. you. He can call it a gift. I want my gift. Well, no. <laughs> Ask him. Ask him, can you have it? Can I have my gift, please, of $3,000? Oh, man. Well, what? right now, currently, I don't have 3000 to give to you, so... To gift to me. Oh, to gift to yes. you? Yes. Openly just let you have well, it? Well, no, it's, it's only enforceable once the gift is completed. A promise of a gift is not enforceable. So if he promises you that today and doesn't deliver it, then that's just that. You still have no legal claim. Well, I just feel like I would have... I can't say to my child, I'll buy you a new car two years from now if you keep your grades up. And I don't buy it. That was a promise of a gift. If I don't have to give, I don't have to give it to you if I don't want to. I mean, he did change my mind. <laughs> if I give him the car, I can't take it back. It's theirs then. 
Well, I'm not really. I have a text that says, like, you agreed to pay me for the money. He never said, no, I didn't agree. No, I'm not doing that. Like, he just didn't respond after that anymore. But, I mean, I have. he's acknowledged that he owes me the money. I have that one's right here. I see it, please. It's this last. Which one? He acknowledged that he owed you. Was the term used? Yes. Owed? You, you agreed to pay for a new car. It's not like I got. What does he say I owed? I agree to pay you because I owe you. Um, well, I mean, I'm, I guess it doesn't really state Did you that sue exact. Her? Sorry, no. She's the party that's responsible. She's liable. He's the victim as you were. But I mean, I was doing him a favor as a friend. Unfortunately, I... you have to get your money from the perpetrator of the crime who did it. He didn't do it to you. And if he wants to be a nice guy later and give you some money, if the person who is liable doesn't, he's not liable. He didn't do well, it. Well, he told me. I got you. He I know has never said you that he's not going to pay me the I money. can only go with the law. Claim dismissed. Go sue the person who did it. Have a good day. <laughs> Thank you. Like, you know you told me you was going to give me that. Right. Like, you know you owe me that shit. Like, come on now. I mean, I honestly felt like I, I didn't have anything to do with this. I mean, we were victims. I'm sure. I was a victim with you. I'm sure. You look so victimized. Thank you.